everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to get this curl to your hair. Um, at the moment it is quite bouncy and full, but as the day goes on it will drop and go a bit more natural looking but still be really pretty and curly. So if you'd like to see how I achieve this look, then please keep watching. So the first thing I do with my hair is I get my paddle brush, excuse the hair in it, it is really gross, um, and I just brush out my knots in my hair because my hair just get quite knotty and gross. So just brush it out to make it smoother. I do it on is washed hair um, because I pretty much wash my hair every second day just because I don't like my hair goes really greasy easy so I just don't like the feeling of old hair um, and it does hold the curls still well um, but it really all depends on your own hair whether it holds it or not next thing I like to use the next thing I like to use is my Vitafy professional CPR um, 220 heat protection thermal spray and it is for sleek, straight and lustrous curls. So I've had this since 2012 because I found out about it at um, my makeup school that I went to. And it just makes your hair so nice and shiny. So I do like it. And I mainly spray it on the ends, not on the root of my hair just because it will help like make your hair go greasy faster and you also aren't putting like the curls like right to your scalp so it's not a problem so I look weird today I look so weird Cameron's making me look so strange so I, if I'm wearing like weird clothes I'm going to work soon <laughs> so I just thought I'd do it um and then what I do is I grab a section of my hair just above my ear and I twist it and it stick it to my head and the the heat killer I'm using today is by Numi and the website is www.numistyle.com um, there's only one heat temperature it's only an on off button it was a cheap thing, I think I paid 30 Australian dollars for it because um, they were having a huge sale. It is an American brand, so if you buy it in Australia, they do give you an Australian adapter. But just letting you know, they are quite flimsy. So I feel like the Australian plugs are a lot more stern sort of thing because all the American things I've bought and they have an Australian adapter, they're quite, what is it, flimsy, I'm not sure. So I have a heat thermal glove on that came with it. I'm actually not sure about this width, um, I'm not really sure with inches, I, I was never good at maths, let's be honest. Um, but it is the bigger one, I think. Or it's a small one, but it's not the really tiny one and it's not the really huge one, it's just the in between. <laughs> so, what I do is I grab a piece, like about that big, and then I roll it backwards and you hold it there for a few seconds. And it comes out with a nice kill. I don't know if you can tell. And this sort of gives more natural curls. And then with the next piece, I roll it the other way so it looks a bit more natural. And then again, roll it backwards. So I'll just show you before I start curling it all. Every hair around my face, I curl backwards. Just because I feel like it gives a more softer look to my face and it frames it just a bit more nicer than if I curl them inwards.
Okay, so I have finished curling my hair. So what I'm getting now is my hair straightener to do my fringe. So what I do is I get my fringe and my hair straightener. And I just curl it up. And then it will match with the hair as well. So I never curl my fringe in either. It's always out. Whereas you guys have probably seen all my other videos as well. So this is it when it hasn't been done anything to it. And then what I do is I'll just gonna but I just flick it all together. And then that is how I curl my hair and that's how I've been curling it when I was curling it all summer. So in some of my videos when I had blonde hair and that's how it is curled. So you can either spray it with hairspray to keep it like super together but I like to let it all fall out, fall down so that it's more of a natural curl. So towards the end of the day it will get more natural and then tomorrow it will be perfect. <laughs> So this is how I do it. I hope you guys like it. Bye.